Kawahara has stopped his opponent in the first two rounds in six of his seven wins. Neither man used to going to deep water. Very wide stance here on Kawahara. Let's see if Adewan can flurry early. Small but excited crowd as one championship kicks off the 2021 calendar with a stacked card. Leg kick from Kawahara, counter overhand right fell short from Lito Adewan. Adewan's going to try to bait Kawahara to come forward and get caught with some of these punches. I like how he's utilizing the leg kicks early because he also knows that Kawahara has really good movement. Lito Adewang in the traditional Team Lokai red trunks. Also has become tradition, the Team Lokai mullet. Leg kicks again from Lito Adewang. The Thunder Kid raining down a storm so far on the legs of Kawahara. That very wide stance may be affecting the ability of Kawahara to check those leg kicks. Moves in for a takedown to no avail though. Right hand lead, stiff jab there from the Thunder Kid. Kawahara did get deep into that takedown, but beautiful defense by Adiwan to stop him right in his tracks. Kawahara the ball flat footed to the two, assuming that karate stance. Switching stance to Southpaw, now back to Orthodox Kawahara. Adawang setting himself. Left hook to overhand right, loaded up the overhand right, but telegraphed it. Drift back to center circle. Nice outside thigh kick to the back leg there from Kawahara. The Thunder Kid clips him over the top. Overhand right coming very close for Lito. Kawahara showed his cards then with the right hand. Outside leg kick from the Japanese warrior. Both these guys are winging the hooks at each other. They are letting those hands fly. Absolutely no filling out process in the opening round. Both men guaranteeing a knockout. Hands low on both. Adewang's got the right cocked and ready. Adewang has had success so far going to the legs of Kawahara. There's a kick to the ribs from the Thunder Kid. It's met with a flurry of punches, but if he stays at this kicking range, Adewang's just a little bit faster with these kicks and he's scoring with the legs. Kawahara wears that leg kick to the back of the calf. Nicely placed from Adewang. Kawahara needs to start committing to some techniques here. And you see Adewang just playing mind games. You mentioned the wide stance in the beginning of the first round, and it's kind of lending to the ability for Adewang to land these leg kicks. A, a wide stance is not conducive to checking low kicks. It's hard to get that leg up and at least reduce some of the pressure that he's feeling from these yeah. leg kicks. He's got to start... Oh, smack bang! Smack bang! Smack bang! Smack bang! One punch and the Thunder Kid is back! That was Thor's hammer in the left hand! The Thunder Kid is back! He had a hard time with the on. range and wow. when he enters the pocket of Adiwani gets put down! What a beautiful left hand. Rich Frank, I can see the, the excitement in your eyes. You're dying to say something. I'm trying to be unbiased here because I have both athletes in the ring, but it's difficult to be unbiased when Leto is the one that came from Can I just say, folks, Ross, right now, right? Rich Franklin has tears of joy in his eyes at this. Leto Adewang from the heartbreak at the end of 2020 to come back in the winner's circle tonight with a highlight reel one-punch knockout of Kawahara. That was startling. That is why they call him the Thunder Kid. Oh, that was beautiful. Man, he packed some thunder in that left hook. What a thing of beauty. This match was presented to you by Petron. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee has called a stop to this contest for your winner by way of knockout. Utah.